Hello everyone and welcome to a new video. In today's video I'm going to be talking about uh, Comfy UI image to image uh, workflows using the new uh, Comfy UI nodes. So I have added uh, ARD math, ARD dual prompt, ARD load image. Uh, this one was a C plus load image in the past. The name is changed from C plus to ARD because C plus was showing like uh, C plus programming language and stuff. So I think ARD is more unique and uh, better to use. Uh, so what this node does is that you just upload an image and uh, what uh, it does is that it outputs all the information from the image uh, for you to use in your workflow. So you get the positive prompt, negative prompt, seed, steps, CFG, denoise, width and height. So whatever width and height you have on the original image, you don't have to uh, look it up or you know inspect it or anything you just connect you can connect it into an empty latent image if you want so empty latent image like this you right click change the width and height into inputs and connect them directly to the width and height and then you take the latent output here and input it into the k sampler and generate and this is what i'm doing in this empty latent image here same thing but what i'm doing is that uh, i'm adding rescaling to the image so i have the ard math that allows you to multiply divide subtract and add uh, the width and height so you play with them mathematically if you like and i really need this for my future uh, notes that i'm going to be making and uh, what what this does so if we have the original image if we want to increase the width by 1.3 and hit generate that what that's going to do is uh, going to generate a image similar to the style of the original with a increased width by 1.3 multiply also we have the ard dual prompt here so what it does is that you just connect it to the clip and positive and negative prompt in one box you can type the positive and negative prompt here or change them into inputs like this and connect them to the textual this is a text output string output you connect them to the positive and negative prompt here of the ard load image like i'm doing in this one and this what this does is it converts the string input from here into a positive prompt conditioning uh, output to go into the case sampler so you need this ARD dual prompt to integrate between ARD load image and the case sampler as you can see here we got a, a wider image which has the style of the original uh, if you want to do duplicates or in painting you just take the image output here encode it and then the mask use it in a set latent noise mask like this and then take the output and input it into here and hit Q and this what uh, will this do is generate the same exact image found here if you want to do in painting you just right click here open mask editor and increase the thickness of the brush and highlight the portion that you want to change so say we want to change this portion here and keep this portion the same hit save and as you can see here we got the same exact image now we're going to hit generate and change this portion here and the way this uh, node uh, works is that if you save using the standard comfy ui save image which is this node here you use this no save images using this node or you use ard save image which is this node here uh, you will be able to pick up all the information from the image using ARD load image and what this does ARD save image and ARD load image are part of the ARD magic nodes available for all members uh, bronze silver and gold what this does is that it saves for civet AI uh, uploads if you want to enable this when you upload your images to civet AI it will pick up all the information of the image without you inputting it if you enable the basic metadata as a minimum uh, all the information will be picked up or the standard metadata which is the comfy ui save image standard node and the workflow here uh, it will also pick up the information 
what this does also is that it allows you to uh, set folders for your output images. So say output Mexican woman, for example, you just hit enter. You can also change the uh, prefix and postfix of the file names. You can also enter author information, metadata, like copyrights or whatever uh, in here. And what it does, it will start saving into this folder. So like you can manage, it's a work organizer, Comfy UI work organizer technically. So it has a lot of usage. So you get ARD save image and ARD load image. And you also get uh, ARD uh, image resize, which allows you to generate different dimensions uh, according to aspect ratio. So that's all included in the ARD uh, magic nodes. You can check them out at my coffee page in the link in the description below. As you can see here, we generated a new image. This portion is exactly the same as the original. The bottom portion have been changed with a new dress and new look. So I hope you like the uh, new notes. Uh, those are free to download. Make sure to check them out in the description. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope you like the, today's video and see you in the next one.